Next up, we got Louis Black drinking in Wisconsin. Bop. Next up, we got Louis Black drinking in Wisconsin. Let's go. Bop. <clears throat> Next up, we got Louis Black drinking in Wisconsin. Let's get it, nigga. A long way, can't nobody tell me shit. I remember long days at the bottom of a fifth. Had nobody in my corner, and I just not no biz. But they see me doing good, and I'm like, who the fuck is this? Yeah, got it. Hello, 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 welcome. If you're new, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, Welcome, welcome, an extra welcome for you for being so loyal to me and taking the time to subscribe. I appreciate you. You could literally be watching anything right now. Netflix, Hulu, YouTube, other videos, whatever it is, but you're here, so I appreciate you. So, to value your time, I'm gonna get right into the reaction video. Louis C.K. drinking in Wisconsin. I'm sure it's about to be a movie. <laughs> Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't gonna say much, man. If you like this video, if you like my personality, subscribe. It's simple, simple. Subscribe, like the video, it's simple. This is the first re first video I'm watching of Louis Black, so hopefully he doesn't disappoint. And we, should, and we can check him out more, but let go. I love Wisconsin. I love coming here. I perform here uh, a lot because I've discovered that you people apparently have some sort of federal grant for drinking. <laughs> it's, you're insane. You pay less for liquor than anybody I know anywhere in the country. Nobody pays less for liquor than you. What are you, what are you, what are you, what are you ha, ha? I don't know if you're using that farm subsidy money. Or if you're just hijacking liquor trucks. But this is fucking insane. Uh, is it volume? It's unbefuckin'-leavable. It's staggering. I come here because basically if I spend four days here drinking, it, it, and even with the plane ticket, it's cheaper than drinking in New York. How do you know when it's New Year's? That's the big mystery to me. What's the difference? I've been in bars here, and it's like New Year's every fuck night. Oh, New Year's, that's when we, we, we drink with hats on. <laughs> now, I've been drunker here than any place else I've ever been in my life. And, uh, and I'll tell you this, and I love coming back here, but I've done a lot of stupid things when I've been drunk. And if I ever wake up with a man, I'm fucking not coming back. Okay? Not for me, not for me. No. I go right into rehab. And then we'll never return to the quiet charms of Wisconsin. <laughs> and you drink on another level. I mean, I was in Ireland and... and, and I was at the Irish Comedy Festival. I'd tell you about that, but, but I don't remember. <laughs> but I had that, I'd been spending a lot more time in Wisconsin. It was my first time in Ireland. I had this feeling that the people of Wisconsin actually were the people who settled Ireland. <laughs> I've never seen you, you fuckers. And it's like, God damn it. Every time I come here, I get this inevitably some point where I'm just, it's just so fucked up it's not right. <laughs> You know, because you always have you got three drinks in front of me. I'll get you another one because this one's free. Mm. You ought to give people who come from out of state a card that says, Hi, my name is Louis Black. I am new to your city and its ways. <laughs> if you find me on the sidewalk, just get me to the following <laughs> hotel. It's unbelievable. 
this is the only, the only state I can tell this story in. Uh, every, because the, you're the only people who understand it. Uh, one night I was performing in Milwaukee, and I finished my set, and it was late in the evening, and I got a, I had a scotch, and uh, two of the waitresses sat down, and they had a brandy old-fashioned. And, and you've, you're the only fuckers who drink that. <laughs> More brandies to drunk in Wisconsin over Christmas than is, was drunk during the entire Second World War. <laughs> I actually had a cab driver who was driving me back one night, and he said, you know, son of a bitch. He said, I was in New York City, and they don't know how to make a brandy old-fashioned. I had to jump over the bar. <laughs> you people are nuts. <laughs> so we're sitting there, and they, at that point, they ordered a shot of Jaeger. Because I guess, you know, I love you. You're the only people who applaud Jaeger. <laughs> and, and I'm telling you, something is wrong with that. You don't even know what's in it. Okay? That's wrong. You know how they make Jaeger? They take all the bar rags in this country and they ring them into a... That's how they do it. And, 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 and even with your lack of response, I can hear after you go, so what's wrong with that? <laughs> Saves me having to just go to the shelf and get all the liquors. <laughs> and I'm sitting there, and a shot of Jaeger rods. I said, no, I've got a drink. And they said, well, have your shot. No, no. It's just a scotch. When I finish the scotch, maybe you have a shot, but you don't have a, a scotch and a fuck shot. <laughs> <laughs> and they said, well, no, actually, you've got two shots of scotch, and this is another shot. Well, with logic like that. <laughs> I said, well, I'm not going to do that. And they said, well, what are you, a, a pussy? <laughs> and I knocked that son of a bitch back, because I'm no <laughs> pussy. And remember this, you were not, you were not alcoholics. You, and my hat is off, are professionals. <laughs> you were not alcoholics. Professional drinker. Is that a thing? Could that be a thing? Professional drinker? I'm sure there is. This whole like um, arm wrestling competition. So I'm sure there's a drink drinking competition as well. There's there's also hot dog competitions. So I'm definitely with with the way they promote alcohol in our society, I can be guaranteed that there's definitely drinking competitions, professional <laughs> drinking competitions. <laughs> touch upon the seriousness of alcoholism and being addicted to alcohol, right? It gets to a point where if you'd rather spend money on alcohol than pay down your debts or take, go attend your kid's uh, recital or events, whatever it is, like, it's, a, it's, it's gotten to the point where alcohol is almost consuming your life on a daily basis, weekly basis. It's time to reevaluate your relationship with alcohol, right? Beyond that, it's also beyond the um, relationship drawbacks. There's also the financial drawbacks. Like, how much money do you spend on alcohol in a month, on a weekly basis? That could be cut in half to to be spent on other things in your life, right? And then obviously, there's the health and health drawbacks. Your liver can only take so much alcohol. Your skin can only take so much alcohol, right? I have a whole video on how alcohol affects the skin, but for the most part, essentially, alcohol has a drying effect on your skin. It, try to, it dries like how fresh and clear your pores are, right? So, everything in moderation, everything in moderation. If any of y'all struggling with your addiction to alcohol, 
Take heed to this video, bro. I got a whole mini course, mini email series that walks you through step by step guided approach to finally stop relapsing and get over your alcohol addiction. Alright. <laughs> but yo, so shout out to Louis Black for speaking on this topic. Um, I saw a comment on this video. It says, um, Wisconsin, out drinking your state since 1848. <laughs> And also, um, keep calm and drink responsibly. Comedian, bro. Comedians in these comment sections. But yeah, I appreciate y'all. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, check out the mini course if you find yourself addicted to alcohol and you just, just want to, if they not even necessarily want to maybe quit drinking, but at least get it to the point where you can now drink in moderation without alcohol affecting and taking over your life. That's all we, that's all, that's, that's my goal pretty much, right? So, God bless, much love, peace and joy, namaste, and always remember, if it doesn't feed you, don't water it. I'll see y'all in the next video. Deuces. I'm rocking it solo, but I'ma go get it regardless of this when I've been on a roll like I'm Toto. I slow it down so you can hear me, I don't want no problem. Started at the bottom, was recording off an island.